Virtual reality or VR is a new area for education. It's going to develop really quick, it's going to become part of everyday life. So we've started to explore sessions with schools where we link in the curriculum outcomes with materials available in virtual reality. So today we've been running a virtual reality workshop with a group of students. Have a look up, what can you see? Oh, oh. We've been looking at some different areas, we've been into space, we went up to the top of the Empire State Building and looked out at the whole of New York. And then we also went back in time into the trenches of World War I. So virtual reality provides students with the opportunity to experience things they may never see. Let's go land on the moon. Okay, let's go. They feel like they're there, so they start asking questions about what's around them. And the great thing about the app that we're using today, Google Expeditions, is it gives you all that information. So as the technology develops in virtual reality, we will be able to develop the workshops to be more advanced and to use more advanced technology. But the key is to make sure it always comes back to the learning outcomes. There's been a lot of research that shows that spatial memory allows you to embed memories much more deeply than reading from text or from watching a video. And using virtual reality, we can embed that spatial memory and assign it with the facts that they need to learn. It allows the students to remember things much, much easier and in much more detail. But can you see these soldiers down here? Yeah, so are they British? Or? Virtual reality at the moment is new, but in a very short space of time, there's going to be the ability for teachers to create content specifically designed for their lessons, so they can place students in immersive environments and then base their lesson plans around virtual reality. I think it's really powerful. And there's so many different places that you can go, so many different ways that you can learn using virtual reality. 